Where's the camera? There. Back again um, to let you know some of the products that I've been using uh, lately and that have helped. Um, first of all, I want you to see now my hair is really like on top of my head. And that's just because I've got this wonderful thing in my hair. <laughs> shaky, shaky. So, um, can't remember what uh, time is now. Well, the time that I have my dreadlocks and uh, oops, <laughs> this one is going. I have to separate them. Oh my god, they're going like nuts. Um, so I put in some jewels and and um, things that I bought online. Everything is going great. And I also got this. And this is so awesome. So this is like a wire that is um, covered in a fabric and it's just awesome. Because um, when you want to make a tail with your dreadlocks, it's not easy. Like I would do it like and then you would have to pull them through and that's, yeah, that's difficult sometimes so this is really actually super they're called spiral locks i will put a uh, link in the description so uh, what i do right now is because i found out that you can you can do this and just put them underneath and just um wrap it around and then you would have like just a, a low ponytail like this but i found that that makes it sometimes you've got still this hair in your back so what i do is i um i don't know if i'm able to catch this on camera go down like I put my head down all the way, I wrap it around, I come up and then it's on a high ponytail, but that's actually really great because it's all contained and um, yeah it's it's all there and it's not bothering in the in the neck or the back um what is a great thing because i work at the daycare center and <laughs> now sometimes those kids they stand behind me and they start going through my hair and <laughs> reaching out for the jewels they find inside and I think it's very cute but uh, yeah so that's what I got and I'm very happy with this because that made my life very easy I've got a bigger one so a longer one that um, makes it easier to make a bun so you make a bun and then you put that around so that's where I'm at. So what I wanted to talk to you about today is dolly locks. Um, I've got the tightening spray. And that helped me a lot when in the morning I see all that fluff and I just put the, the spray on it and um, it maintains. <laughs> the fluff a little bit and apparently my colleagues seem to love the scent of it so I'm like yeah that's Nakshampa so uh, I spray that on my head when I put it together and just to maintain the frizz a bit but also in between washing I wash my hair once a week um, I've got the refreshing spray 
and it smells so good and that's just when you find that like sometimes I'm sweating a lot especially in the back of my head like in the neck so I would put some refreshing spray over there just to have a clean a clean head uh, but <laughs> I wanted especially talk about this product so uh, what's it called it's uh, some powder that is used to lock your hairs now from uh, first hand experience I'm like don't overuse this because I was using this and I put a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot on there, too much. And when I was going through my hair with my fingers, they would turn like it's it's purplish, a purplish dark brown. They would look like like oh my god, it would give off, and I used too much. So you have to be very very economical with that product just put it on here and there not too much like i would just go <laughs> because um i used it and it was too much even so that when i thought yeah it's gone i don't have like these finger tips issues anymore i would stand in the shower and wash my hair and it was just like come down like I would see this purple go down and I was like oh my god that's really too much so um, yeah this is a very good product it did help to knot up some bits on the top of my head but uh, I wouldn't overuse this so uh, yeah I've got some cool things like here going on and here with that. <laughs> oh, and I washed them today and now I smell all the Nakshampa. So, again, um, comments are still, um, let us say, there was one... Uh, one parent, one uh, woman, I love her very much. She's very easygoing. She's really sweet. And she said to me, oh, I love your hair. You did something. I love it. And I was like, I thank you so much. Because most of the people are looking very weird at me. And she said, don't. Don't mind them, do what you want to do. I was like, oh, thank you, you're so sweet. But yeah, uh, I'm still happy. I'm not going to lose them uh, anytime soon. I'm going to keep them and keep maintaining them. And I did some maintaining. I did um, some crocheting, which I wouldn't recommend, but there were just too many fluffy hairs. Um, but I'm still happy. Ow. <laughs> and especially with that, um, that thing. Like, let me make it one more time and I'm gonna keep it that way because now I'm cooking dinner and uh, I want to diamond paint some more. Yeah, I've got a diamond painting channel as well. So, um, just wait for me. I'm going down. Just putting the spiral around. <clears throat> there you go. So that's what I would look like on uh, working days. For some of you, it might be, might look a bit crazy and everything, but uh, yeah, it's the easiest way to keep it out of my face, keep it 
a bit off of my back because it's heavy it's it's even they're not they're just baby dress and it's it's starting to get heavy so um that's the way it looks on the back i don't know if i'm on camera right now well i'm on camera but i mean if i'm in uh yeah you know what i mean so still happy still convinced no one is going to make me think otherwise i'm uh, i just feel like now i need to pull a bit because uh, they are starting to grow together and i'm like eh, no keep I, I want to keep them separate but uh, thank you for watching Hope you have a splendid week and I will see you whenever I've got something new to add. <laughs> Thank you. Bye.